try my best to give videos of this today, but basically today I'm adding another super to the bottom because um, the bees are pretty much drawing out a decent amount of comb. It's a little overcast today, so the bees might be a little bit more um, touchy, but uh, there's the hive right now and I'll take some videos in between. As you can see here, we got our top bars and we got the top bars that we modified from the Langstroth hive. So these are the Langstroth hive. These are the top bars and we did ours and we had to move ours in between so that they weren't building comb on them at first. But now you'll be able to see them kind of building comb on this one right here. Just kind of see them building some comb right there. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some of these today and put them over on our new super and uh, take some, transport some of these into there so eventually we can weed all of these out of here if possible. So I'm gonna try doing that now, I'll be back in a second. I'm going to put the new top bars on, um, or the new uh, super on, and as you can tell, most worry keepers um, will nail these in. Um, I'm, we're gonna try it without nailing it. I just simply marked the spots where the bars need to go. Um, so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna remove um, some top bar from there and I'm gonna stick them in here to encourage them to start building the comb on here so I'm gonna do that now second bar I did um, I'm not sure this one was in the back of the hive and they started building comb on this one but the one in the center they're not um, I don't know why but I'm gonna take a look at that it looks like they're building the other combs just thicker I'm gonna set that in here and I'm gonna call that good for this one for right now I'm gonna put the other hive body back on top now I got the feeder right here. Um, I'd be curious to know if anyone knows if this is a great thing. The I saw some, uh, there's a crack in the bottom there. I don't know if you can see it. But I saw some, uh, some dripping on this top bar. So I don't know if that means that it's dripping out and that's a bad thing or maybe even if that's honey. I don't know, but I'd like to see definitely some suggestions on that. So I'm gonna put this back on now and uh, close up the hive. And this with one hand but probably shouldn't, but whatever. So as you can see, these top bars are just full, man. I can barely even move them. Um, this one I think is combed to the bottom. So as you can see, this one is is doing really well. Got some brood comb in there, got some larvae. I still have not been able to locate the queen on this hive. But I'm gonna put this down because I'm gonna drop it, so, the phone. So here's one of the things that sucks. So, um, I'm gonna like some advice on this too, maybe from some people. I put this, this last top bar right here, as I was pulling it out, the, the uh, the uh, comb split in half and so I'm gonna try to remove the comb and set it at the front of the hive but I mean there's nothing else I can really do I mean it's sitting off to the side so I'm gonna set it out here in front of the hive and uh, just call it good I guess you know obviously they can get whatever honey they can from that but kind of sucks um, I'll show you after I get it set I'll show you what it looks like after I get it out so all right bye so I would say it was a semi-successful super ad. Um, obviously, you know, I don't want to do this um, ever again if I can help it. But there's some honey right there that they're hopefully getting up. There's some brood comb that was on there right there. Um, I mean, I don't know what else I could have done. So I'm a beginning beekeeper, obviously. But I removed, I removed the top bar and it was stuck to the bottom. And so uh, it just ripped right off. And... I don't know what else really I could do. So I'm gonna let this sit here and hopefully they'll get it up. Um, like I said, any advice um, would be encouraged um, just because um, I'm new. So I'll compilate these all together and then I'll ask for advice after. So 